What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? We are back with part six of Mafia 3. So, let's get into this. And guess what, guys? I have finally technically graduated high school. So that means I'll be moving on and actually getting an actual job. Now, what is it we have to do here? Smack. Wait for Donovan. Okay, where the fuck do I go for that? I know, I gotta... Alright, fuck it, I'm just gonna run out here. But yeah guys, I have finally graduated from high school. Well, the graduation's in a few weeks. Possibly around two weeks. You know, we got celebration day next week. And then I'll be officially gone, but I don't have any more school. Which means more time with you guys. It is amazing. Wait, what? I did never knew. Never knew you could even do this. What the fuck? You can actually do something like this? You can actually break into somebody's house in this game? No way! That's fucking sick! I've never known that. I would have done it. Alright, we're going for a little run, guys. And I'm going to do a jump cut here, and I will see you guys in a minute. Alright, guys. We are here. So, I ended up stealing a car after fe realizing how far away I actually was. And I was like, I am not walking that. And when I stole a car, I had to run from the cops because there was a witness. I also had to... I also died because I jumped off a freaking bridge trying to escape the cops. <laughs> so this is taking me hits. like almost eight minutes that to do. That heroin the Dixie Mafia has been selling? <laughs> Run out of there by a man named Charlie Kincaid. Meaning all the other dealers around here kick up to him. Charlie stays away if he can help it, so you're going to have to put the squeeze on him. I flagged a couple of his guys. You get them to talk, they'll tell you how to get to him. Now from what I hear, Charlie's only in this for the money. He's not a true believer like those other Dixie Mafia assholes. So maybe if I talk sweet to him, he'll decide to bail on Doucette and come work for me. Assuming I can draw him out. I got something I can help you with that. That's what I wanted to show you. A new Bordeaux's on a standard communication grid. So getting a system of wiretaps up and running should be fairly easy. Just install this little beauty on a junction box, and I'll be able to construct an intelligence map of the nearby area. How many more of these you got? Just those. The parts are on an agency watch list. But if we manage to dig up more of them, we could wiretap the entire city. All right. God damn it! People think living under these commie motherfuckers is so great they should move their asses over to Moscow. When you find more of these, you bring them to me. You are way too sensitive about that shit, man. Oh, fuck those motherfuckers. Fucking traitors. I'll see you when it's time to move against Charlie. <laughs> Right, why tap the first Baptist church? Why tapping rackets? To why tap rackets break into junction box boxes which can be found around the city. Oh, that seems pretty self explanatory. Gotcha. I'm such a pro at lockpicking this stuff. Why tapping rackets? Why tapping rackets? Why why tapping shows enemies on the mini map as well as targets of opportunity and collectible. Why tapping also allows you to recruit racket bosses for more earn. Why tap? I got another achievement. What? What? Alright. To why the box you need? Alright. Yeah. I'm just gonna take this car because this car actually looks fucking beast. No! <laughs> the way I killed him was so brutal. Oh shit. Interrogate. Alright, well. What I'm going to do is I'm going to park my car right here. Sup, lady. Looking fine today. What do you say about the 
Four finger Charlie told Zeke to go fuck himself. So they're just informing. You see, here's a bad thing. It's the fact that I don't got any ammo left because I wasted it on this one motherfucking person. I wasted it on this one person. So. belongs to us. I didn't find uh, shit. God damn. Bonjour. I'm gonna see if I could do this the whole time. Huh. Oh, that got him. I'm thinking we ain't alone. Oh no, what do you think that? Up. Fucking yeah. Can't hide from me, boy. Odds ain't leaning in your favor. <laughs> well, shut Fucking take you down, bitch. Since I've got no ammo, I'm going to. Oh shit. Is that a pistol? Yes, there is a fucking pistol. Get the fuck down. out. Going for a ride. <laughs> Yo, how good church. was that? That was amazing. And I almost killed the guy too. I shot him twice in the head and he's just like, I'm fine. I'm not dead yet. Alright, I've got to interrogate him with that bar ahead up the top. So you just drive reckless. So it's pretty much like one of the GTA missions, where um, where some missions you have to try to interrogate somebody. Now doesn't always fucking happen in every GTA. I don't know why I'm still mambling on about it. Forget what I said. <laughs> Witness is calling police. Alright, um, but I've experienced missions like this in GTA. I'm just gonna keep driving straight until he starts to tour. This seems like a very straight road anyway, so it should be easy. Spill, let's go. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Holy shit. What the fuck? Why the fuck was there a fucking Alright, give me a second guys while I fix this fucking... Alright, so... I kind of ruined... The interrogation process with that. So... I am going to actually... What I'm going to do is I'm going to try it again with another person. This time we're not going to drive into a fucking piece of water. What's four finger got going on at the church? There's all kinds of dope over at the church. He's just aiming his gun like, what you gonna do? You work for me now. Oh, I added him to my racket. What is he? What do you think you're trying to do? Alright, I'm just gonna. 
taking my fucking rip whip. I think I've never like completely failed a mission to the extent where I have driven a freaking guy that I need to interrogate into the water. I've never done that before. I never fucked up that bad. Oh, that, that, they're over there. Am I able to get through there? <clears throat> Let's check. Seems like it. Yeah, it seems legit. Oh, I can't. That's the fucking bad part now. Fuck! Alright. Well, it looks like I'm running around, guys. I will jump cut this part. Alright, so... I think I managed to get around. I didn't read that. I am stupid, because I may have needed that. But... I have gotten around now. Doreen's knocked up again. <laughs> Congratulations. Like I need another goddamn brat to trip over. Hold her to get on the goddamn that hell. Was squirrel. She's too Catholic for that. Uh, I've got ammo now, so that's fucking good. Don't holy shit! I'm done playing with this asshole. What the fuck? Yeah. The, the way you kill him, it's just the most brutalist way I've ever seen you kill him. See, I can go through these missions and just knock them straight out or kill them with a freaking knife or something. Was he going for the police? Alright. I'm gonna need to run back. Run! I'm almost dead, that's why I needed to run. Alright. Play fire with fire, motherfucker. Doesn't seem... I'm pretty sure I can... Uh... Targets. Targets of opportunity of the people and money making operations for a racket. Destroy them to damage a racket. <laughs> How the fuck do I destroy him? Oh. Oh, fuck. Boobies. Boobies. Fuck! Holy shit! Fucking shooting at me like that! Holy fuck! That took so much fucking health away from me within fucking an instant. Is that it? That one didn't really get destroyed. I don't understand, because I'm pretty sure. Oh. Oh. That's what I had to do. I feel stupid. These are the type of missions that if something doesn't break when I'm trying to break it the first time, and I have to do something extra, I will fucking be like, well, I think I messed the game up. Alright, I think I've got to interrogate about one more guy, from the looks of things at least. Oh, he's coming straight for me. 
Hey, he's coming straight to here. You're gonna tell me about the Ooh. dope operation. At least that guy, one, another one, didn't see me. Yeah, I need you. Stay close. Kill Charlie's enforcer. Witnesses calling the police. Nope, you ain't calling shit, bitch. I'm a dip. I'm a dip before the police get here. He's not even dead. I recruited him. How are you gonna say that? And a homicide. Fucking recruited him into my shit. But now we're gonna go kill one of Charlie's enforcers. Or is it? Is, is that the only? Enforce that Charlie has. If so, then uh, sentries. Sentries are enemies who call in reinforcements. Sentries call in reinforcements. Neutralize them before they reach the nearest bomb. Oh Hopefully, this is easy. Take you down. I am going to try to lure I all of them out to me, and then I should be able to take them down quite easily. Well, got no business here. I guess not. I guess that's not how it's going to work. Yeah, nothing's. Yeah, nothing happened there. After I tried to do that. Huh? Don't leave. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Yeah, come get it. Yeah. Oh fuck, now I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Alright, we need to get the fuck out of here. Oh no. The fucking cops. I was hoping that cops wouldn't see me so I'd get the fuck out of there. Alright, I ended up cutting all that out, like a bit, a lot of that. For the reason is, I thought it was done. I thought this mission was done, but I wasn't sure. So, I did kind of drive around for a bit, and then I realized we're not done yet. I still got a few more guys to kill. So, we shouldn't have much more to kill now. There was a guy over there, and I knew there was a guy over there. There we go. And time for me to break this. Uh, I killed the enforcers, took them down. Now we're gonna go back to talk to Donovan. Uh, I'm not fucking with these fucking guys, so I'm going to just run. Soften them up. This is like a car my dad has. That car that I just parked. But I'm going to take this one instead, because it seems faster. Alright, give me a sec guys, I'm going to jump cut this. And I'll be back when I arrive. All 
Uh, so we're back. Continuing. I've been listening in on old Charlie, and he isn't such a bad fellow. He's more of a kinder, gentler redneck. And as luck would have it, his wife is expecting. Man in that situation usually doesn't care who he works for, as long as he's still above ground. <laughs> Poor sap starts blubbering when the two of them talk about names. Right now, it's between Bocephus and Thomas Lee. Anyway, his guys have the church locked down, and all of them are more of the shoot first, let God sort them out variety of redneck. You get your hands on Charlie, though. He'll do what he's told without putting up much of a fuss. All your intel's been updated. You going back to the motel? After I get something to eat, I'll see you when you're done dealing with these inbred assholes. Alright guys, I know it's, we're about to like, try and get to Charlie, but I'm actually going to end this video right here guys, and I hope you guys enjoyed, it's almost like a 30 minute video right now, but I will see you guys in the next video, like, comment, and subscribe yeah. for more daily videos, this one and, and I'll see you guys later. To make them feel good. Looking in the mirror like what you gon' do The only one stopping you right now is you Yeah, I promise I'ma fight working every single night Cause it's not where you're from, but where you going to A natural part of life, yeah, I know that things change Been trying to manage green like my name was any Ainge Paid all the haters, no my name was Snow Tech 9 Cause now the new music sounds strange Big city dreams, but a small town kid 